fingers crossed now see you gorgeous people welcome back to my channel i know i'm looking like a hot mess but today i'm going to try something very interesting look what i have with me ready hair colors we are going to apply hair colors on our hair i mean my hair i'm going to apply it on my hair and this is not permanent hair color so no commitments not even semi permanent hair color this is temporary hair color so basically it's a one day wash off hair color like you put it for one day just enjoy the new hair color for a while and then wash it off the next whenever the next wash day is or maybe the next day i have not tried it so far but i'm going to do it in this video so keep on watching and this brand is called beauty pure they come in number of shades i think 7 and i was like let's just go for the funkiest ones blue and purple i love blue and purple this is from korea made in korea and they sell in various countries and it's obviously not just for curly hair it's for straight hair curly hair wavy hair men women anyone can use it it's a creamy formula and there's mica in it for some shimmer and shine even after it dries so maybe that's going to look good on hair but i'm not sure how it's actually going to look on this jet black hair it will obviously look good and great on bleached hair or any kind of hair that's lighter in shade so if you have that kind of hair do give temporary colors a try i'll just give more suggestions in the description box do check them out as well and they also say that there's no downtime you just need to apply it on your hair with your just bare hands not even gloves so we'll see that so finally without further ado let's try it so basically that's the reason i have not really done my hair at all by done i mean my hair is in total mess most of the definition is well intact thanks to the shingling method i have been trying um, these days do check the video and try it for sure it's in two languages english and hindi try it and you will have the best wash days and next days also i need to refresh plus i have really dry hair dry curly hair so the color won't spread on my hair right so i will just dampen it a little bit that will also refresh it refresh the curls and then on the damp hair i'll put these colors if you have straight hair or the kind of hair that can be nicely combed and still looks good you don't need to do all of this before putting on the, that hair color you can just simply take it out and use it on your hair should i go with blue Just go with blue hair and purple hair. That way, you can also see how it looks like each side. And since I have black hair, I am going to take a lot of quantity. Interesting. Very easy to glide on. It's got very smooth, creamy texture. But where's the color? It's all gone. I'll just take another round. this is how it looks and i think one third of the tube is gone time to open the purple i love purple comes with second seal oh it's beautiful purple look it's better than blue actually fingers crossed This is how it looks so far. How do I look with blue and purple hair? And some more. Oh, it's already done the putch. Okay so I think I'm done I'm not going to put more because it's going to then feel a lot productive my god it's looking nice it's actually looking nice but I think it's going to fade a little bit once it's all dry so I don't know but it looks nice for now and as for the mess you can see it has not transferred much and must have transferred on my clothes also 
yes little bit but according to the company once the color is all dry it won't drip and it won't transfer so i don't know about it i'll come back and review it for you hope my satin robe gets washed off properly bye bye hey i'm back my hair is almost dried and i think the color outcome is really good really really good i really like it this purple side especially and the blue is also looking very electric uh, let me increase the brightness so that you can nicely see it see if i come closer it's even more visible okay i hope you can see it better now so currently my hair is feeling crunchy because uh, i had the stylus in my hair and putting water it just reactivated them and then the gel cast is all over again plus i put on some more product that is the color the color so we are going to break the gel cast as usual that we do for curly hair if you have straight hair or you do not use stylers you don't need to do this i don't think so if your hair is feeling crunchy or something you can just smoothen it out like put your hair between your hands and just do this or just comb it out but i have curly hair i'm not going to comb i'm wearing uh, satin mittens it's transferring a little bit though see so I, what i'll do is i'll just clap 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 instead of gliding it otherwise maybe it will just take off all of the color so there was quite some transfer while scrunching out the gel cast i think it's looking very nice and i thought because i had put on so much product so much color it will feel very producty and dirty but it's not which is a good thing as for the transferring let's check there is nothing wow that's impressive there was some transfer on my robe while i was applying it but after that none that's impressive that's definitely impressive i'll give you another update tomorrow good morning you guys it's day 3 after coloring my hair i didn't like remove even the bonnet yesterday so i don't know how my hair is looking how much the color has lasted or transferred yeah, let's see ready 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 all <laughs> bad i think in the natural light it's looking more vibrant than it is in tube, under tube light i mean so it, the color has lasted pretty well and if i touch my hair it's not transferring and it doesn't feel like i colored my it feels like like it i have like the real permanent kind of color i really like how it's working here you can see there is literally no transfer i don't know for what reason there are various surfactants in both of these i can see that it's there in very less concentration because it's among the last ingredient list like less than 1% or maybe lesser than that so it maybe it's because of the thickening stabilizing thing or it could be um, to wash off the product easily i don't know what is the reason but yeah i have told you what i know so now let's talk about these what do i think about them i think from my previous experience of hair temporary hair color these were really easy to use and they do not feel producty so that's a good thing and the color is also showing pretty well on my black hair however i had to use a lot of product you saw in the video while i was applying i had to use multiple layers and it's not cheap it's 60 g for 749 rupees maybe you will get it on discount on amazon so should you buy this i think if you want to go for some creative fun no commitment nothing and you want some purplish bluish hair like me you can of course go for it but at the same time do not leave it for more than 2 3 days and do not use it day after day after day that can affect the hair and if your hair is healthy or healthy ish then of course it's better than coloring and bleaching any day so that was my review of beauty pure colors the temporary ones the blue and the purple one let me know what you think and let me know if you have tried any temporary hair colors and how did it go for you did it transfer like i have heard that curl smith red one specially they transfer a lot let me know in the comments and let me know if you want me to try any other uh, hair colors so i'll see you next time in my black curls back again <laughs> till then please uh, share this video with your friends whoever wants to try colors and do subscribe to my channel like this video leave a comment if you really liked it bye bye